Welcome back to Pentacor 2, folks. We won in Stalingrad, and now we are faced with a decision. Uh, we can either break out west, which would take us down the historical branch, break out west from Stalingrad, or we can break out east, uh, or fight eastward, and that would be the non-historical branch. And, I mean, we know what happens in the historical branch, right? Germany loses and the world is saved. However, I want to play the non-historical branch because we don't know what's, what that is. And the historical branch, I guess we won't be able to invade England and stuff like that, which I want to do. So we are going to take the, uh, the non-historical branch here. So it costs us a thousand prestige to take that we had 3699 i think we stand at a unique crossroads head general securing moscow last year was brilliant only surpassed by your recent conquest of stalingrad that said fresh soviet reinforcements are already on the move in an attempt to encircle your forces i believe you can turn this crisis into opportunity and obliterate their winter offensive before it properly begins Mm-hmm. Okay. By striking at a series of targets along the Volga River, you can cut through the vulnerable rear of the Soviet forces advancing westward. This maneuver will cut off the spearhead of the Soviet forces, potentially enabling you to weave your forces behind them and crush their strongest forces after removing all of their support. If your Stalingrad weary forces can pull this off, I think we could be in reach of delivering a death blow to the Soviet war effort. Fight bravely. The end of the tunnel is in sight. Okay. So we get a new hero. First aid restores one point of strength. Every turn the unit did not attack applies to infantry units. Okay. That doesn't sound too bad. So we have some, uh, some blue friends down here. And when they're blue, it means that they move on their own. So I don't get to control them, even though they're German forces. Uh, they work on their own. So yeah, we'll see how they do. I'm not too convinced they'll be super useful. But we'll see. They can at least uh, protect our rear or something like that. So he suggested to move up this way and then come about and move in this way so I guess that they have a lot of strong forces over here and maybe not so much over here uh, support forces over here uh, that's at least what his briefing suggested we have eight victory hexes that we need to take four of them five of them we can see here six seven what? One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. What? Three there. One, two, three, four, five there. Okay. So that makes eight. So that makes sense. All right. We have 2,699 prestige to reinforce and upgrade and stuff. So I think I'll go ahead and uh, do all that as usual off camera and uh, then uh, we'll, we'll see what happens here. We'll see what happens. So uh, I'll be right back. So we have deployed our units and let's, uh, let's have a look at what has changed. First of all, I have on this guy I have put our first aid guy in there and taken the learns from mistakes guy off because learns from mistakes means more XP from from uh, from casualties and this guy is basically full so that seems reasonable next we have actually downgraded our tanks I'd say they were four G's so the 4G if I took that 
I would have to have them at uh, 10 strength. They do. They are quite a bit better at uh, fighting infantry, so 12 to 20. And they're also a little bit stronger, the 4Gs, uh, against tanks. But their defense is a little bit worse. And having them at 10 strength instead of 12, I think, uh, I think it's reasonable to 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 do this. So we have overstrength our tank tanks to 12 and downgraded them to Panzer 3Ms. We have our two uh, recons. We only had one in Stalingrad. Now we have two. I had one in reserves, which I brought out. We have our two martyrs, which I upgraded to three H's instead of threes. So they're a little bit more powerful. These three stews, 42s, they are pretty cool because they can either be artillery or anti-tank. So I changed all our 15 centimeters to these stews so that we can use them as either or. It seems like a tanky uh, scenario, to be honest, with uh, all this space uh, and not so much uh, city, so it seems uh, quite tanky. So I think it's going to be useful to have the stews. We still have our two uh, 21 centimeters and we have our Gustav for regular artillery. We have three anti-air, which we can also switch to be anti-tank if, uh, if that becomes necessary. Our fighters I have upgraded to uh, 190As, so if we take a look, they cost two slots extra, which is quite a bit, but they're also quite a bit more powerful. Uh, air attack, two extra, they have more initiative, they have more air defense. Uh, so yeah, pretty, pretty decent upgrade there. And then we have our two Stukas and our bf 110 g So let's go ahead and uh, end the deployment. And see what happens. And our friends start out by attacking. So let's see how they do. That was a decent first attack in my opinion. Okay. Doing okay so far. They are doing okay so far. Well, I am a little bit worried about this infantry over here. We need to do something about him because our Gustav is right there and we don't want him to be... Uh, to be attacked. They overran those two, which was nice. So let's start back here. Let's actually send you over here and attack those guys. And then you can come over here. All right. It's sunny, so we can use our planes, which is nice. So let's send you up here and take that out. That's a good start. And we'll send a fighter with you. I want to have a fighter over Gustav at all times. So he doesn't take unnecessary damage. Do you have extended range or something? Ah, oh, you do, because you're on high ground. Fair enough. Right, where are our recon guys? Let's 
02 seems okay. We'll pull you back. We're gonna take this slow, I think. So over here, it doesn't seem like there's much in the way of tanks. There's a little bit of... Hmm. I'd rather have you up there and uh, defending. Gustav can move forward and shoot once at you, taking you out, nice, and then take a shot at you. You can come in and cover Gustav's rear. Let's send you up here and see what we see. Okay. Still no tanks. I really don't like you put, putting you in the swamp, but it's not swamp, it's clear because it's, I guess because it's, um, This is the stew. I guess it's because it's frozen. Right, let's switch you. Oh, wait, can't I do that? Switch. So we don't see any tanks just yet. We still have some planes that we can use. We will send you down here and be above Gustav. We'll send you over here. We don't see a whole lot just yet. Oh, there's a tank. Okay. Can't move anymore. I think that's it for the turn. Oh, there are some planes there. Okay. See now, I wish I didn't hadn't turned them back to be artillery. The three M's are taking some punishment. Guys are gone. Very nice. Overrun there. Now, we didn't get any prestige for him taking that. So we don't want our allies taking the cities. Fine. One, one. It's snowing, so we can't use our... Hmm. Pose one four is acceptable. Actually, wait, because we do have our artillery here. Let's 
We have Gustav as well. I want Gustav to come forward. You can come forward. All right, very nice. And that took Gustav up to five stars. So his fast learner is now useless on him. So we need to change that up. Let's just stick you in there. I'm gonna fast move you forward because it seems like our buddies have this handled. So zero zero, that's not good. Zero one, that's acceptable. One zero is not. Okay, I think we'll send you along that way as well. Might as well do that. Panzer 3M. Don't want to put you in the woods. Okay. I think that's everything I want to do. six it's kind of reasonable but I'd, I'd leave him unsupported by anything which I don't want to do so we'll just end the turn hmm, maybe they don't have this handled down here I hope they're not using my prestige. That'll anger me. strength infantry down there and the three and a 15 and the anti-tank there so I'm not entirely convinced that they have it under control it's sunny so let's use our planes shall we
nice. And we can use a fighter to cover both of them. And we can use you to bomb that guy. You to cover it. He's pushed out. Very nice. Nice. Overrun there. And that wasn't an over and oh that was because it was a stew. Let's undo that. That's a stew. This is a Panzer 3M, so let's overrun. get up there you can you can't attack but you can get up there switch you to be artillery oh there's a Recon there. Okay. This fighter needs to come down here on top of Gustav. That's not where I wanted to put you. Do I mean with the Gustav and that Hmm Get in there Do we want to put the martyr up there? I don't think I do We have this guy, and we have this infantry, but until these guys are dead, I don't want to... You know what, we'll move the tank forward and we'll move the infantry back here. You just stay like that. All right, I think we're done. Oh, here come the aircraft. Yeah, go ahead and bomb the allies. It makes me very happy that you're spending time on them instead of on me. Still want to knock their aircraft out of the skies, though, as soon as possible.
Why are they not finishing off those three infantry over there? These three guys. I would really appreciate that. Well, they finished off those guys. Finished off that. Alright, go finish him off. Thank you. Okay, so they have the situation down here well in hand. Alright, let's see what our fuck wolves can do. Zero four. Okay. Can you finish it off? No. That's unfortunate. Well, you could. Nice. Let's just take that out. can't really attack here. We can finish that off. And we can move up here. One, two, zero, two. Well, we can circle that. One, two. We need you to come forward. Two, two, one, three. One, two, zero, three. Okay. Uh, wait, because it's probably going to retreat, right? Yeah. Don't need that much infantry up here, I think. But I can't be sure. Alright, let's slowly creep forward here. We'll start with the recon. Okay. Well, we see something. tank support that's fine There's some good stuff up here take a shot at you I wish I could use these but until we have control of the skies I don't want to leave them unattended it seems like this is under control so let's start moving these guys forward a bit
Alright, this seems reasonable to me. Haven't, uh, you, we have moved you. You can actually move, but I don't want to move you anywhere. You can move. Let's move you up here. So that the stew is covered. This stew I don't like having there, but nothing we can do about it. All right, let's end the turn. So all their planes are down there. Well, they are targeting our tanks. Didn't do much though. Very good. This is gonna get double anti air. Still took out a artillery, but we got skilled support, so that's nice. Okay, they finished off the guys back here, it seems. Gonna send you up here. T16Y08. We are getting cover there. 108. Not bad. I'm gonna stick you right there in the hopes that I can get. What's it called? Gustav up there. Okay. Why two, three? Ah, it's an anti tank. Hmm. Okay, that should help. That stew can move up there. Okay, I'm pretty happy with this. We took out a couple of their planes. You are already covering... We're already covering the Gustav. There's a... Ooh, how far can you reach? Range 4. One, two, three, four. They can't reach the ghost off. They can if they move forward here. One, one, two, three, four. Uh, God damn it. I really hope they don't shoot the ghost off. Ah, and here. We took out three of them. do to this anti-air? Nothing because you can't reach it. You know what? I'm gonna leave you unattended. Or actually I'm gonna leave you unattended. And send you over here and... Okay. So it seems like they are coming with some stuff over here maybe. But let's 
elite replace what we can and we'll just take a second to you come over here you can pull back here uh, you can come up there you can come up there Actually, let's move up here, cover more of them. Okay. So there's definitely something over here. That's an artillery and a recon. I might be wrong about that counterattack from over here. It just seems so logical to do that. Really? Well, so you are... In there, that's fine. Let's do that. In there, that's fine. I don't want to move you because then this everything is open. We'll elite replace you. And that's the turn. Oh, here they come. Well, at least a recon is coming. Dang it. Oh. Into the air. Oh, he can get in there, can't he? No, he couldn't. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Tank, tank. Where are you going? And it's snowing. It's snowing. All right. So we have something in here that we need to take care of. Okay, seems like I can't really get it, not on this turn anyway. Come back here don't like having the martyr out there in front I'd much rather have it in behind some tanks like that though I would very much like to know where the heck that thing went finish that off Can't really move forward on this turn.
Right. We're taking it very slow and we're doing that on purpose. Just to... Be a little bit cautious and not overextend ourselves. And turn. There's still that guy in there behind us somewhere. At least our 17s, they are, or 21s, they are doing counter battery fire, which is nice. Jesus, look at that. Look at all those units they're coming with. Jesus. Well, at least our allies are moving up. And we see him. We can overrun there and get back into line. I love that Gustav. I guess you're just staying there for now. What? Let's move out and see what we can see. Not much. All right. One five seems reasonable. See, they have some anti air there. Okay, you. Let's destroy that. And then you can cover Gustav. Which means that these guys are free to go play. Nice, plus three to heart attack. Oh, there's NTR there as well. Okay, plus one to heart attack. Alright. That was a pretty good air round. So five, I like it, even, even though it didn't turn out to be true. Nice. Let's get that anti-air destroyed as much as we can anyway. Are you 
you can actually move. But do I want you to? If you move up here, you don't have empty tank cover. But if you move in here, then everyone has empty tank cover. Which seems quite appealing to me. So Panzer 3M, Panzer 3M, Panzer 3M. We have Stu, Stu, Martyr, Martyr, Infantry, Infantry. All right, that seems pretty darn good to me. They're not moving. They're they're just staying there. All right. Okay, okay, okay. I think that's the turn. That is the turn. Yeah, you're staying right there. That's the turn, and that is also the episode, guys. I think I'm, we're I think we're doing pretty well. We've taken out quite a lot of units, done a lot of damage. Uh, I think we're covering our tanks and everything pretty well with the, these stews. I, I really like those. And uh, yeah, we'll see how it continues in the next one. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.